May 16, Thursday of the fourth week of Easter A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John When Jesus had washed the disciples' feet, He said to them, Amen, Amen, I say to you, No slave is greater than his master, nor any messenger greater than the one who sent him. If you understand this, blessed are you if you do it. I am not speaking of all of you. I know those whom I have chosen, but so that the scripture might be fulfilled, the one who ate my food has raised his heel against me. From now on, I am telling you before it happens, so that when it happens, you may believe that I am. Amen, amen, I say to you, whoever receives the one I send receives me. And whoever receives me, receives the one who sent me. The Gospel of the Lord The one who ate my food To illustrate the gravity of Judas's betrayal, the evangelist presents Jesus quoting Psalm chapter 41 verse 10. Even my trusted friend who ate my bread has raised his heel against me. Among the Israelites, Dining at table is not just a matter of eating to satisfy one's hunger. People recline at table and eat leisurely, enjoying the gift of the Lord and manifesting the close ties that bind those who eat together. Dining at table is eating bread and salt with someone, signifying a covenant of friendship. What misfortune and pain it is to find out that someone who shares one's table, a friend, has turned against oneself, as the psalmist says, while pouring his heart before the Lord. Have we been hurt or betrayed by someone we considered our friend? Have we in turn turned unfaithful to someone who considered us true friends?